Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel and if you're new to my channel thank you so much for stopping by now don't forget to click on the subscribe button and the notification bell for more upcoming DIY future videos. For this DIY, I would like to share with you how I created an easy to make tufted mirror using a pillowcase and metallic party beads. If you would like to find out what I created, just continue watching. To start off, I'll be using a 16 inch round foam board that I already pre-cut and a 19 by 19 one as well. Next, I'll be using a 6 inch round mirror and I took it apart. I took the mirror and placed it in the center. Next, I traced the placement. Next, I'll be using a set and pillowcase that I purchased from Dollar Tree. Once I removed it from the packaging, I'll turn it inside out. I'll be cutting both sides of the seam. And don't forget to follow me on my social media platforms, link below. Next, I iron the fabric on low heat. Once I was done, I placed my mirror in the center and then I'll be tracing it with a fabric marker. Once I was done, I cut out the center. For the remainder of this DIY, I'll be using my strongest glue sticks. Once I was done, I took the fabric and placed it over the 16 inch round board and then I glued it in place. Next, I'll start cutting the fabric going around one inch away from the foam board. Once I was done, I flipped it over and started gluing the fabric around the edges. If you like this video, please give me a thumbs up and share. It really helps me out a lot and it lets me know that you enjoy videos like this. Next, I'll be using pillowcase stuffing and I'll be stuffing and gluing it as I go. Once I was done, I closed it up with hot glue. Next, I apply a generous amount of hot glue and then I place the mirror in the center. Next, I'll be using Gorilla Tape glass beads and jewelry making pins i'll be placing the pins inside the glass beads as i go i'll be placing them two inches apart in a staggered position by just pushing the pin down into the board and taping it in place I repeated the same steps going around. Next, I'll be using my 19 inch round foam board and I'll be making two holes five inches apart. I'll be placing ribbon in between the holes and this will be to hang it up on the wall. Next, I'll bring back my tufted board and I flipped it on the back side and apply a generous amount of hot glue and then I turned it around and glued it on the board. Next, I'll be using silver beaded party necklaces and I'll start gluing them around very closely together around the board. I also glue beads around the mirror. Next, I'll be using medium sized gem and I'll start gluing them inside the tuften. Next, I'll be using iridescent glitter glue and I'll be gluing them in between the beads to hold the beads better in place and also give it some shimmering. 
Once that was done, I let dry for a whole day. I really do love the way this tufted mirror turned out and what I love the most is the satin look and all the shimmering. This was a very easy mirror to create and I didn't have to use any staples or screws. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this DIY as much as I enjoyed creating it. Now don't forget to like, share, and subscribe and turn on your notification bells for more upcoming future videos. I'll see you on my next DIY upload.